with a dish that contains brown sugar, jackfruit, and bananas. This is my take on the traditional Filipino dessert, Toronto. Start off by grabbing your bananas. It's best to use plantains. Go right ahead and peel your banana. Grab your knife and prepare to start chopping. Cut off the ends of the banana, as you don't want that in your tarot. Start off by cutting the banana in half, and in half again. Keeping in mind that one banana equals two tarones, cut as much bananas as you need. After your bananas have been cut, it's time to cut the jackfruit. Get the jackfruit lengthwise and cut accordingly as shown. Get your spring roll wrappers ready and it is time to wrap your tarone. Start off by getting a quarter piece of your banana. Then roll it in brown sugar. Make sure to get every part of that banana covered in brown sugar. Once that's done, place it back on the sheet. Get the jackfruit and put it on the sheet as well. Once again, grabbing another quarter banana and putting it in the brown sugar, making sure it's completely covered. And place it back on the sheet. Now it's time to roll. Start off by getting the bottom edge of the wrapper and putting it over the top banana. And roll it upwards. Then bring the right and left edge towards the center once you're at the top, go ahead and get some juice from the can you got the jackfruit from. Use that to seal your tarot. Once that you have finished wrapping your tarot, it's a good time to start warming up your stove. Place your pan that you've been using to fry on the stove. Raise the stove temperature to medium heat. Once your pan is hot, go ahead and add the oil. Once the oil heats up to temperature, it's time to start frying your tarot. Go ahead and test the oil first with a piece of the wrapper. If the wrapper starts frying immediately, it's time to start frying. If not, give it a few seconds. Once the oil is hot enough, go ahead and place your tarone in the fryer. Flip occasionally until you see the tarone has reached a golden brown color. Once it has reached a golden brown color, approximately 5 minutes, go ahead and take it out. Once your tarone is done cooking, go ahead and put it aside for now. In a small Dutch oven or a mug, go ahead and put some brown sugar and the rest of the jackfruit juice left over from the can. Put it in the microwave for about a minute. This will create a nice caramel glaze on top of the tarot. Once that's done, 
go ahead and put the glaze over the tarone and serve. For a list of all the ingredients with the exact proportions, go ahead and check the description below. If you like this video, go ahead and give a thumbs up and comment on what you want to see next from me. Also, subscribe to my channel to see what else I've got. Thanks for watching from Aragon Pictures.